Hi, in this video, I'm going to walk you through some basic Power BI functionality. Okay, so let's begin. As you can see, I'm on the web. I'm on my app.powerbi.com application or Power BI service application. And I signed into my account. And as you can see, this is my home page. And I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to click on the Power BI project file. Opens up the report. And as you can see, it's blank. There's nothing in here. And that's because I haven't built anything yet. So we're going to proceed and we're going to click on edit. And that enables you to build your application. Okay, add visualizations to the application, make modifications, whatever you need to do. Okay, um, lots of features here. We're just going to cover a few right now. So as you can see here on the right hand side, okay, we're going to talk about some of these different features. So I'm going to go ahead and we're going to start with data, for example. Data here. I can click to collapse or expand out this data bar. And as you can see in the data bar we have here, this is the data I imported. These are the fields or variables I've imported in the application. This information came with your application. The data and the actual database table, if you would, came with the application, okay? The next section here is, I'll explain this out, is the visualization section. This lets us build our visualizations, the bar charts, the line charts, tables, etc. Okay, we'll cover that throughout the course of the course of the videos. Finally, there's a section here called filters. I'll expand that. And briefly, this lets you add filters to specific applications. Again, we'll cover that as we build our application. Okay. Over here, this is our canvas dashboard, canvas, whatever word you want to use that we'll be adding visualizations to. OK, when I work on these, I personally like to collapse these so I can, you know, kind of see the whole canvas, if you would. Down here in the lower left corner shows me the page number I'm on. I could obviously click on this, rename the page or duplicate the page. We'll cover that later. Up here in the navigation up here, the navigation bar, I have uh, various opportunities here for saving, printing, downloading my file. View here, one thing I like to highlight is I could turn on the show grid line. So when I'm building my visualization, it makes it easier to line up the visualizations on the page. So I like to turn that on. Over here on the right side, we have features such as this icon here lets you add a text box. This icon here lets you add shapes. This is a very important icon because you can click this to save your report as you're working on it, okay? So these are just some of the basic features. I'll show you one thing. I'll click on visualizations, for example. And if I want to add a visualization, much like we've done in other Microsoft applications, it's a simple click, drag, and drop. So I'm going to click on pie chart, for example. And I could drag it around my canvas. If I want to place it here, for example. Then I can click on the corner to make it larger or smaller. And then up here on the far <clears throat> upper right corner, there's some options such as share, remove, spotlight, whatnot. This icon here lets you do a focus mode or enlarges the, the visualization for you to view more details. I'm going to go ahead and remove this right now. And like a best practice every few minutes, I'm going to click on save to save my application. And again, these features we're going to cover in future videos, but I just thought I'd take a moment to just give you a high-level overview of the, of the functionality of Power BI. Thank you for watching this video.